everyone. Welcome to Sherry's Too. Do it again. Do it. Let's do it again. Do it again. Do it again. Hey guys, welcome to Shay's Too. And I'm back again this weekend, guys, to give you guys a brand new haul. I just want to say thank you to all my new subbies. Thank you. And thanks to all my subbies that, that was with me from day one. Day one? Not day one, but day 10, day 15, something like that. Okay, thank you guys. Okay. <laughs> and also, if you like this video, you can thumbs up this video. You can also leave a comment below. And if you're not subscribed to my channel, please subscribe. And you can follow me on Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, and of course here. And check out my book that I co-wrote. Not my book, but one the book that I co-wrote. Baby Mama Chronicles at createspace.com and amazon.com and on Facebook. You can also check out my Shea Butter line. Not line, but just my Shea Butter, okay? At Made in Star Natural Teens. That information is below on Facebook and on Instagram. And at Made in Star Natural Teens at yosite.com. As well as go and show some support for my uh, soccer academy that I co-own. And that is, that is at Made in Star Soccer academy on facebook okay i'm, I'm about to say I, I am about to say dot com okay there's no dot com for that yet it'll come soon but it's mating star soccer academy on facebook okay just go and um like that page and follow it okay just showing support okay okay so i went to dollar tree I don't think I got anything from the 99 cent store this weekend. Yeah, I don't think I did. I just think I went to Dollar Tree and got a few things, and I want to show you guys what those things are. And hopefully you can go and catch and get some of these things as well, okay? So let's go ahead and start off with... I know this hat. Okay. I cannot believe I got a Dollar Tree bag versus having that Walmart bag. BT, welcome to Texas. No, I'm just playing. <laughs> Because um, when I first moved to Keller, Texas, um, DQ commercial says, DQ, you know, then they'd be like, welcome to Texas, you know, so I always think about that when I say Dollar Tree, when I do that little thing thing. Yeah, okay, anyway. Anyway, I went to Dollar Tree, guys, and then I want to tell you a story about when I went to, when I went to get a pedicure. I can't go into too much details, but I'm just going to tell you a little bit of it in a minute, okay? But anyway, let me go ahead and, go ahead and start off with this haul, Okay. So I got some of these spring bouquet flowers, okay? I don't know what type of flowers these are because I'm not good with naming flowers and stuff like that. But anyway, they are so cute and the color is absolutely beautiful. I always say that word wrong, but it's, these are actually so pretty, okay? These flowers, yeah. And it's just cute. I like the color. It's very cute. You guys, you like these? Do you like these? Do you like these? Well, you better get on to DT and get you some, okay? For a dollar. Because you go to Michael's, you're going to pay a little bit more, a lot more than a dollar. I think I showed you guys my roses I got at um, Hobby Lobby. These are so cute, though. Yeah. Okay, so that's what I got. That's one thing that I got. Let's put that right there. And then the boring thing that I got is some more batteries. But actually, these batteries work pretty good because I use these batteries in my son's remote control car. Okay? And they work pretty good. The Sunbeam Alkaline High Drainage Batteries. So you may want to pick these up if you need to put them in a toy or something like that. They work pretty good to be only a dollar a piece. So as you see, I got two. And I did go to a new store, guys. I, want to show, I do want to show you guys what I got from that store. Uh, I had never heard of it before. We just happened to pass by and went in it, and I was shocked at the prices. But I'll show you th that after I finish with this DT, showing you guys everything I got at Dollar Tree. And then, of course, I got some more of this bath tissue by Home Store. I told you guys before, this tissue is pretty good, okay? It's not all hard or anything. It's not too soft where it tears. The particles does not fly off of it or anything. So if you see this at your Dollar Tree, buy the home store you may want to go ahead and check this out and get yourself four rolls for a dollar you can't beat that okay i got a, a couple of these um i got a couple a couple of um packets of these okay anytime i get on camera guys i start messing up more i told you guys that before okay so you have to bear with me 
Then I got some of these Sure Fresh reusable snack containers for my daughters when they go to school. Because they, they now go to regular public school for right now. They wanted to go. They asked me, so I let them go. I usually let like them make their own choices about stuff, so I let them, you know, go. But anyway, they just started about a week ago, and, it, and it, it's okay so far. But anyway, I decided to buy some of these to put some little snacks in here so they can take it to school. So I got one packet of these. There are three in here. They're microwavable. Let's see, are they? Honestly, I don't know about the microwave, but they're BPA-free, okay? So that's a good thing. Okay, that's by Sure and Fresh. Then I got some of these little multi-pack round dollies to put on my table so it can match up with this after Easter is over, okay? So I got these to just put on my two coffee tables, okay? And there are 32 pieces in there. That's a lot, huh? I doubt I'll use the small ones, but hey, you never know. And then they got some of this Auschwitz tape by Curad. I've never seen this before at Dollar Tree. And if you're latex, um, if you have a latex allergy like I do, this will probably work good for you. So I got like three or four packs of these, okay? Yeah, okay, so that's that. And I got some of this athletic tape by Assured. So like if you have a little sports person in your family, they can wrap their ankles with this or either a dancer. I got these for my daughter because she dances to wrap around her feet. Because if you go to the regular stores to get this, it's going to be way more than a dollar. So I got a couple packets of these. And um, you see how much is on there. It's a lot on there. So it definitely will um, last a long time. So I got like four or five of those. Then I got this little cute sign for Easter oh, with this glitter on. I hate glitter, guys. But hey, it's a cute sign. So that's why I got it. I got this to hang up. I didn't need any more Easter stuff, but this is so cute. So I decided to go ahead and pick this up. This is adorable. And put somewhere in my little apartment. You like that? Yeah, I like that. I'm so silly. <laughs> okay, I got to put this back in this bag because I don't like glitter all over me, huh? Okay, I do not like glitter all over me. No way. Then I got some more Assured um, Road Gauze stuff to put back in my first aid kit. Because I actually bought this for my feet. And I'll tell you about that in a minute. <sighs> this is some pretty good stuff. Um, it's 3 inch wide. 7.6 centimeter. Okay. So that's by Assured. They got some good... Assured makes some good brand products. So that's why I like to use Assured products. And then there's the other athletic tape that I got. Then I got some Obolero body cream. This is in the Moroccan mint and raspberry. This smells pretty, pretty good, okay? So I got one of these, if you can see that. Yeah. That container is a 3.5 fluid ounce. And then I got some more spearmint gum. There are four in a pack. This is equivalent to the big pack they sell at Walmart, okay? I like the smaller pack because that way I won't eat it all up so quick. That's one bag. The next bag, I got some more of this booster, fragrance booster by, I don't know who this is by, Fresh, no, this is in a fresh scent. Okay, fragrance, and this is, um, I don't know who this is by, but it's in wash fragrance booster, and I always use this, and it makes my clothing smells really, really good, and it's not too strong. I just use a little, okay, just a very little, you can see that. All right. I got some spa soap, the refill. Okay, pretty good stuff. I like it. The consistency is good and everything. And that is the 32 ounce container. And I got some of this Sure Scent Waterfall Crystal B refill to go in my little container that um, you can put these inside of. These don't really smell that long but it's good for like in the closet somewhere that's very small and it'll last a little bit longer in there okay so I got this color they come in all different colors too and it's by sure sense and this is the waterfall smell this is a 10.6 ounce container as well there you go okay next bag I got one of these little cute potato mashers by cooking concept they have a whole line over there uh, 
with these copper candles and things like that. It actually, this, this matches the bowls and the cups. I already have the cups. I bought two bowls and the salt and pepper shaker. So I got this just for, you know, cooking with. And that's that, okay? Cute little set. I got some of these multi-surface wipes. They say there, there is a bonus 20% more. This is by the home store. And these are real good for stainless steel appliances, okay? I use them on our stainless steel appliances. And they do, this does work pretty good. So you may want to go ahead and give this a try versus buying the more expensive brands at the other stores. This works pretty good, so you want to try this out. You can also clean the glass too with this in the top of your if you have a glass top range you can use, you can clean the glass top range with this as well so i got two of those and then i got this little kneeling pad not for outside but i got this for inside when i be kneeling down on the floor doing things versus getting a towel or something to put my knees on i can use this instead because i don't want my knees all dark and stuff like that i finally used the shea butter that i sell along with cocoa butter turn my knees back to its brown original color. So I, I don't want them to darken up again because I'm on my knees on the floor doing stuff and things like that. You know, when I do my exercises and things like that. And then I didn't even realize I bought another Easter decoration for my Easter tree. to hang on it. So I got this little cutie thing right there to hang on my tree. And I got a sign to put on my patio just to bring in the spring that says welcome this will stay up the whole year you know the rest of the year for summer and for spring okay this will stay up then so that's what i got there okay and i think that's it that's it guys i can't believe that's it from dollar tree now i'm going to pause my video real quick and i want to show you um some stuff that i got from you know i can't even remember the name of the store but in a minute i'll tell you just hold on for one second you know um, go get you some pop, hot chocolate, coffee, or whatever, okay? And I'll be right back, okay? Oh, I'm going to have to get in the way. See, you can see my knees, see? Oh, man. Let's see. Okay, so we went to another store. What is the name of that store we went to, guys? Fellies? Fellas. Yes. Who? Fellas. Fellas? Yeah. Okay, let's see. We went to Fellas, okay? And Fellas out in, yeah. Um, I didn't find a cutting board. Go get, it's underneath the sink. Get that because I want to show them that too. It's um, in, the one we went to is in Oceanside, okay? And I found it by mistake and I thought it was like an army store, but it wasn't, okay? It's not an army store. It's just a regular store. They sell um, regular clothing for everybody in the family at um, affordable prices. They had jeans and stuff in there for children for like $5, for like $7 and $10 pants and everything. And not no raggedy, worn out, ugly pants. I'm talking about brand new stuff, okay? In good condition, you know, just like any other store. And they had household products and um, towels, rugs, clocks. Clocks were like, I wish you could see that big clock I have on my wall. They had those big clocks, you know, the big round ones. Um, they had those clocks in there for like $7. I paid like $30 for mine, okay, at Ross. And then they had um, just all types of stuff, lamps, everything. Everything was really really cheap and this and then they had the nerve to have a sale on top of that okay so it was really cheap and so when i went there they had a sale on these comforters right here this is a twin size for my daughter room these comforters are normally forty dollars there but they were marked down all the way to i don't even know you know what they're not normally forty dollars you can see the price right here this one right here normally was fifteen dollars and this is not a comforter either this is a Oh, it is a comforter set. It's reversible. Okay. This was marked down to $9. Can you believe this? $9. So I got this one for my daughter's bed. And then I turned around and got a blue one for my other daughter's bed. Okay. And this one was, okay. I'm sorry, guys. The regular price, I, I always be wrong. The regular price, that one right there, the one that I showed you before, the pink one, the rose color one, that one was on sale for $14.99, okay? It was normally $39.99, okay? But 
when I went to the cash register, we had the wrong blanket, and I thought it was $9.99, so she gave it to me for $9.99, okay? But the sale price is actually $14.99 for that one, and the, the regular price is $39.99. And then we saw this one right here, and this one's also like $39.99 or $38.99. I can, I can barely read that because I don't have all my glasses, so this one right here is $38.99, I think, for real. But it was marked down to $9.99 at Fellas, okay? And see how that is gorgeous, okay? Good quality because I actually looked at this and then put it back in here. We put it back here all nice and neat and everything. But anyway, yeah, that was a pretty good, oh, don't let me hit nothing else. That was a good, 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 good price. And then they had, oh, God, it's good. What she got in this? They had these book bags right here, right? How much was these book bags? These book bags are $10 a piece. They're not all flimsy and cheap either. They're very durable in everything. Um, you see, she got a lot of stuff in here. And then they had all types of these, okay? My other daughter got a black one. And then, of course, this one got this pink one. And they both were $10 a piece, $9.99. That's a good still because we go to the regular store, it's going to be more than $9.99. And then I turned around and got a cutting board set. I got another cutting board. It's bigger than this one. Okay, it's a standard size one. Then these two came with it. This right here was $5.99, okay? And it's not all sharp on the end. Like if you buy one from other some other stores that may sell them cheap, they'll be sharp on the side. You can't do that. I still don't want to do that too much on this one, but you really can't do it with those cutting boards because the wood would be, you know, um, in your fingers and everything. So it was three came here, and the other one is a little bit is larger than this one. I actually just got my toaster sitting on top of the other one, okay? Because I got so many cutting boards, it's a trip. And then um, Deshaun, let me see that racing car. I want to show you guys his racing car that he got because his racing car was only $9.99. And I thought it was going to be a flimsy little racing car that don't really work, you know, that stopped working out the first two tries. Honey, that car is really, really good, okay? It zooms across the floor. We even took it outside and did it. And it works very well. And like I told you before, I put those little cheap um, Dollar Tree batteries in it, and they um, they work. They work pretty good. Look, guys, this, this is my toes, my toe bucket. You see them? <laughs> This is the design that she did on my toes and f my other toe up. You know what I'm saying? I wish I could say that on camera. She f that toe up, man. Okay, and stuff. But, this is, but my toes look good. They look good. That little flower decoration on it, it, it is cute. But she messed my toes up, honey, when she cut them. With what I don't know. I, I don't even know what, what, what instrument she was using when she cut them. Don't get on my camera. So this is a little cute little car. It's not that big, but still, for $9.99, I thought this thing was not going to work that long. And it works pretty good. It zooms across the floor. I, I try to control it, but I couldn't sure. and stuff. You don't need to show them. I already just told them. And it has a little controller, remote thing goes with it and all that. So that's a good steal for $9.99. Okay? And I'm talking about so you got, drone for 40, who? $40. I'm going to buy it. The drone. They got drones in there for $44 or $40 or something. He, he, he just said he's going to get one. But, like, if you have to get a child, if you have to get a child a um, gift or something, fellas is a good place to get it at. They got some cheap price toys. They're not cheaply made. They're just cheaply priced. And I forgot the re she told me how they're able to do that, but I can't remember exactly what she said. But they got all types of clothing. I can't wait till I go back and get some jeans for him and they get them some things because I'm going to show you guys what type of quality of clothing they have. So if you have a fellas, they also go by another name. I can't remember the other name. What's the other name they go by, Jay? Uh, or Chloe? Huh? I forgot. Okay, we forgot the other name, but there's another name they go by as well. But if you have one in your area, check them out because they have some really great prices on book bags, clothing, um, sheets, comforters. A comforter for my bed was on sale last week for $19.99. I just didn't get one. Okay. Um, stuff that you put in the bathroom, you know, like if you want to decorate your bathroom. I don't know if they had pictures in there. I can't remember. But I actually think they did have pictures in there. I just didn't need any more pictures. And they were like $5 and $10. It just depends on what size you want, size you want to get. And they just had everything in that store, okay? So if you have one in your area, check that out and see if you like what they have in there. Because you can never, um, you know, get enough bargains, okay? Because these stores sell these things for so high, but then they buy these things in bulk and get it low, but then they sell it to us for a lot. So anytime you can find a store where you can get good quality um, clothing or merchandise at a cheaper price, you basically want to go there and try to get it, all right? So that's it with my haul, guys. I know I got a bunch of bloopers on here, but that's okay. 
That's okay. I told you guys that I was camera shy. I just figured that I would probably get on cameras more often. Maybe I'll get more viewers or whatever the case is. My daughter, um, she has a YouTube channel and she just got 919 views off of one video. Okay, and I was like, wow, how did you get all those views on one video, girl? I'm up here, I'm up here jumping up and down for just 400 views. <laughs> And 206 or 9 subscribers. And this girl got, I think, 6,000 subscribers or something like that. Or 9,000. I can't remember. And she don't even be on YouTube. That video that got 900 and some thousand clicks on it is two years old. Okay? And then I got good products. I got good stuff that I'm showing people. I mean, I be, I, for real, I be showing some good stuff. Y'all be missing out when y'all don't watch my videos. You be missing out. I be, getting, I don't be just getting no cheap stuff. I be getting some good stuff. Okay? For real. Just like that little shaver thing that I got. That trimmer that you guys probably didn't see. That um, Dollar Tree was selling. And you can actually use that trimmer to um, shape it up to, um, you know, clean up your eyebrows in between when you get them waxed or whatever. You get them, you know, um, threaded or whatever. And you can also use it underneath your arms and your bikini line. I used it underneath my arms in my bikini line and it worked great okay okay great better than a razor i love it i can't wait to shave again and you guys probably missed out on it because you don't watch my haul okay just like all the other things the pictures that i got like this picture up here you can't really see it right now but you can see part of it okay the alpha tower picture that picture i can't even remember how much it was i think it was like 9.99 or something like that at 99 cent store these are the things you're missing out on when you don't watch my channel Okay, when you're watching other things, you need to watch Shay's tube, this Shay's tube right here, to see the stuff that I got, because I get some good stuff. You see those comforters? If you don't watch my channel, you won't know nothing about fellas to go get them for $9.99, even the regular price, $14.99. Where can you buy a comforter for a twin-size bed for that amount? $19.99 for a full-size or queen-size bed or king? The king probably costs a little bit more, but I'm just saying. Okay, you can't get that. Usually when you get something like that, it's all flimsy and it comes off the bed and you wash it and start tearing up. This don't do that. Look at a cutting board. $5 for three pieces. What can you get one like that at? Okay. And then look at the little flowers at Dollar Tree. Hey, all Dollar Trees don't sell flowers that look this good. Some of them look a hot mess. And you know that's right, honey. So, yeah, you need to watch my channel and tell people about my channel because I be showing a lot of good products on my channel. And, no, I don't get on camera every time because I'm, I'm camera shot. I told you guys that before, you know. Sometimes I get on camera, though, like I'm on camera today. But that don't mean I'm going to get on the next two weeks. <laughs> I'm so <laughs> Maybe another six months. But, hey, at least I'm on there. You know what I'm saying? You know, it's amazing how I can go on smooth and sing on camera. But it's not live camera. And this is not really live, but I don't know. I don't know why I can get on smooth and sing and do a video. But it's hard for me to get on YouTube and do an actual live a video like this. If it was live, I wouldn't even be able to do it, okay? I'm just be perfectly honest. I wouldn't even be able to do it, you know, because I'd be messing up and everything. Here, I can stop this. And if I don't like the way I sound, if I'm looking tripped out, I can record this video. Because after I get through doing this, I will look at this video and see what I look like. I know I'm doing bloopers with my speech. I can't help that because anytime I get on camera, I always get nervous and forget what to say and say stuff weird ways and things like that. That comes, you, you, sometimes you have to take classes for that. You know, even though I did take speech classes and things like that, still, to get on tube, sometimes some people have to um, take diction and, you know, um, just take classes on being on YouTube. They have at the um, place where my children go acting classes, they have classes for YouTube. And my daughter was like, you may need to go in there and take a YouTube. <laughs> Uh, class so you can get on camera and know how to talk on camera and things like that and I was like girl I'm not doing all that because I don't even really do my channel to generate funds or anything I just do it because I like to you know and everything so you know this is what it is this is what it is but you guys need to t tell people about my channel so people can see all these good things that I have because if you don't tell them they're not going to see it and they're going to miss out on a lot of good things, okay? Just like that shea butter I told you guys about. I told you guys to go to my Made in Star Natural Teens Facebook page and check out that shea butter. Do you see how my skin looks? You can see it on camera, okay? This is the first time I really showed myself on camera. This is from the shea butter, okay? And cocoa butter, okay? I'm going to keep it real with you. From shea butter and cocoa butter, okay? I don't use anything else. This is what I use, okay? Shea butter. I told you before, shea butter is a good, good butter to use because it's more like your body. Um, it's more, uh, I can't, 
remember what they say, it's more compatible, I'm gonna use that word, with your body, okay? And all the things that your body produces on the skin and everything, it's just, it's just better for you, okay? Plus, it's an inflammatory, it has inflammatory properties in it, so like if you have a, a sting or anything like that, you can actually put the shea butter on it. I can even put the shea butter on my toe, I'm just not gonna do it because I'm going to a doctor and all the other stuff, you just can't put anything else on there, except what they tell you to because you avoid any soups or whatever you're trying to do, okay? And plus, you don't want your feet to get, you, know, you, just, you just got to follow directions, okay? But you can put shea butter on small cuts, you know, you can put it on insect bites, you can use it to even up your skin tone, you can use shea butter. They say shea butter helps diminish wrinkles, okay? I don't have wrinkles, okay? Granted, I don't have wrinkles anyway, but I'm just saying I don't have wrinkles coming either because I've been using that shea butter, okay? I've been using that shea butter. And then they said it also helps with, um, stretch marks now this now i can say it does help with stretch marks it really does it diminish those stress mark stretch marks some they claim it helps with cellulite and i can say along with exercising and eating properly it does help diminish your cellulite you know if you if you massage the shea butter in like i do twice a day along with exercise like stretching or something like that it would help diminish or fade that stretch marks you know not stretch marks but the cellulite I was telling you about, because my camera went off because I'd be talking so much, but since I'm on camera, I was like, I might as well um, tell you guys, I'm going to my knees down, what I was um, about the shea butter, okay? As I was saying, this, the shea butter helps to diminish, you know, cellulite, you know, along with regular exercising and eating properly and things like that. You can diminish cellulite off your thighs, but or wherever you have it. You know, you just have to massage it in there twice. And that's what I do. I massage it in my thighs twice a day. And I concentrate heavily on the areas where I see cellulite forming or it's already there. Just to, the massage alone helps to um, loosen up the, um, the fluid or whatever. The blood that's in your thighs. In the, the, um, the connective tissue, I think. I think that's right. In that. And that, along with massaging that shea butter in, into it, helps to diminish the cellulite. You can read more about it, because I may be saying this wrong, but you can read more about it, because you can look it up online, and you will see it and everything. And then my shea butter is 100% natural. There is nothing in it, okay? Nothing. Nothing. It smells just like it would smell when it comes off, the, when they when they get it off the tree, off the, the, um, the little plant or wherever it comes come from on the tree. It smells just like that, okay? And I actually like using it. I mean, the smell is okay. You're not going to smell like a perfumey smell because it's 100% natural. So you're not going to smell a perfume smell. But the smell, it goes away once you apply the shea butter on your skin or on your um, up in this area. I don't put it on my face. The only place I put it at on my face is because my face is very, very sensitive. And I can't even put shea butter on my face. But the only area that I do put shea butter in, on is I'll put shea butter right up in this area because when I wear my glasses, it leaves a dark mark right here. So I use the shea butter for those areas. And then sometimes I put shea butter on the side for crows, the crow's feet thing. And, and I used to put it underneath my eyes, you know, but I don't really put it underneath my eyes too much now. But I still put it on the sides for very little and then I put it right up in here and massage it into that area just to um, lighten that back up. And everything but that shea butter is pretty good to use you can use it even on your baby for um to prevent diaper rash you know you can just put it so many places okay you can put it on your elbows on your feet to make it more smoother um you can even even when you shave after you shave you can put shea butter under your on uh, your eyebrows to diminish bumps and things like that and itching you can put it on your hairline all that Look up shea butter and you'll see everything that you can do with it, okay? And then just go to my site, Made to Start Natural Things. Not natural things, but natural teens on Facebook or either on Instagram or either at your site. You'll see all the information below. I sell a 2.8 ounce container for um, $5.99. And check that out. And then I gave you guys the, the wrong name to the Sports Academy. It's actually Made to Start sports academy I, I always say soccer because that's the first thing we're doing right now we just started up a soccer team a little league soccer team we're going to start a older league as well but right now we're doing the little league soccer team and so I, instead of me saying sports academy I, I always say soccer academy but it is made in star sports academy so just check that site out 
and just follow them and like the page. That would be great, it's just to show support. And y'all, my stomach is not as big as it look on camera. I was looking on camera. <laughs> I was looking on camera and I was like, damn, your stomach look big, girl. It looks big. It's not big like you think it is. Trust me, it really is. Because I'm sitting like this. I'm sitting like this. When you sit like this, not with correct posture, it makes it look like your stomach is kind of big, bigger than what it actually is. Okay? So if I sit up straight with perfect posture, then you can see that it's not as big as it may look. I mean, it still look kind of big. <laughs> okay. It's still, you know, I still got a little bit tummy. Okay? But it's not like like when I'm going to sit like that. Okay? When I'm sitting like this, it makes it look... <laughs> it makes it look larger. I just noticed that because I, I looked at my video. And I was like, damn, girl, your stomach look kind of big, girl. <laughs> you may want to do the video over again. But I was like, please, girl. Nah, I'm not going to do this video all the way back over again. No. No. And then my daughter got to know to ask me, can I do a split? What did you just say, Jay? Can you do a split? Tell me, can I do a split? And I was like, girl, no, I can't do no half of a split I can do. But not no whole split like she can because, you know, she dances. Okay, I can never do a split, a whole split. Not even when I was like 18, 19, 20, not even a 16. I could never, ever do a whole split, just a half of a split. Okay, and, and she wanted to make jokes and stuff. I want to see her after she have children, and when she get my age, I want to see if she can do the things that I can do, that I can still do, like get up on my head and stuff, and raise my body all the way up. I want to see if she can still do all that when she gets my age. Okay, and guys, my birthday is coming up on the 22nd. I'm one year younger, okay, <laughs> and everything. March 22nd at the house. But anyway, guys, thanks for watching my video. Um, again, you can thumbs up this video if you like. Excuse any bloopers, any language bloopers, or whatever the case is, okay? Excuse this tummy, 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 okay, um, and um, whatever else, okay? And, yeah, if you're not subscribed to my channel, please subscribe. Again, thanks to all my subbies. And share this video if you like. It was nice seeing you guys in person. Okay? <laughs> I'm so crazy. It's ridiculous. You're going to find out that I'm so silly. It's just crazy. Okay? Oh, you know what? I'm always forgetting something. Let me show you these few little things real quick because I forgot about these things from Dollar Tree that I did not show you guys. I got some of this mouthwash, guys. Okay? This is the fluoride type by Assure Bubble Gum Flavor. And it's anti-cavity. I got it's alcohol free too, and cavity protection. I got this for me and my son. I use this too, only once per day, with a little water to it, because fluoride is not all that great for you either. But you need it for your teeth. That's what they say anyway. So I got this for us, okay. And my girls got act, because they didn't want the off-brand stuff. All right. And I got um, they had these little. I forgot to show you guys this. They had these little cute. These little cute cups right here, hun. I mean, come on now. These are really cute. I had to get one. I had the, the lime green one, too. This color, along with burgundy and red and lime and sky, and sky blue, those are my favorite colors. And black, those are my favorite colors. Okay? You see, this almost matches my nails. Okay? Favorite color. Okay? These cups are BPA-free. They got the little thing on them, the little handle. I love this. I love this. Yes, I do. Okay? So I got one of these because I had to throw my other cup away, okay? And I probably I may go back and get a few more of these just to have them as backup because they had like green, purple, and blue. So I'll probably go back and get a green one. And then I went to um, Rite Aid and they had these on clearance. These Jelly Belly fragrance um, candles. So I got two of these. They were, these were 50 cents a piece. And they normally are a dollar and ninety nine cents a piece. So I got these. They smell good in this container. So I hope, hopefully, when I like them, they will still smell good. Okay, and that's it. Okay, I saw these on the couch and forgot to um, include them in my haul. So that's why I just wanted to show you guys real quick. Again, guys, thank you for tuning in to Shades Talk. Thank you for tuning in to Shades Talk. And I'll see you guys in another two weeks. I got thrown off a chat because my daughter um, put my video out late. The other one that I just did last weekend. So I had to come back with this weekend to do this video to get me back on track. Because you know I do videos every two weeks. And so this video right here, um, I put out a week later. So therefore the next video will be two weeks from now. My newest video will be out in two weeks. Okay, I just wanted to catch up. Alright, this video actually supposed to be going out in the next two weeks. But I wanted to show you guys the stuff that I got. 
this week first, you know, and then you can see the other stuff that I get next two weeks or whatever. Hopefully Easter won't be here by that time, but okay. But anyway, happy birthday to all the March babies again. Have a great remaining weekend. Um, I don't know what else to say, guys. I think I'm done. I think I'm done. I think I'm done. And thank you for tuning in, guys. And you know what I'm about to say. You know what I'm about to say. This is what I be doing, guys, when I be doing this ending. I be like, you know what I'm about to say. Hey, you know what I'm about to say. Yeah, that's what I be doing. I be doing all this crazy stuff. See, guys, you normally don't see me doing this stuff. And this is what I be doing when I be counting and stuff. But anyway, <laughs> thanks for tuning in to Shades Tube, guys. And I'll see you in two weeks. One, two, three, uno, dos, tres. I'm out. Bye, guys. Bye, guys. Ta-ta. Now I got to get up. Would you mind if I wait here? Would you mind if I wait here?